Hey guys, this is Jay Cruz from Team Shockwave. I'm here for tips and tricks on the new Blue Eyes structure deck with Blue Eyes Mating. So here's what I've researched so far and some of the rulings on the card for you guys to be aware of. So here we go. Alright guys, so as you all know, this is Maiden. She's beautiful, she brings out her blue eyes and a lot of people are expecting a tremendous amount of her. Um, I've been playtesting, you guys saw me open up the structure deck and it went good. I've been playing for a month and a half or so since the, I did the video last time. And the deck's been pretty working out great. I hope you guys seen our video with Parker and me playing spell Dark Magician versus Blue Eyes. But um, this card pretty much says control, um, especially if you guys are trying to combine it with Colosseum. That's really great right now in the game. This and this is... It's just amazing because it makes your opponent either want to attack it to get another monster out and then from there you end up just saying all right you got a blue eyes on the field your opponent doesn't know what they want to do they can normal summon another monster and then from there they either going to exceed synchro summon or they're going to set back rows and they end their turn you'll go to your turn and from there pretty much you could overlay um you could go into your draw phase Go with blue eyes, sync with that, and just go into blue eyes silver dragon. Yeah, I know they changed its name, but I, I'm gonna call them from the original. But pretty much, I find it a great combo. You have Colosseum, your opponent will probably have one or two monsters because you're trying to control the field this way. You sync to this, your opponent can't do anything. You'll still have one monster run over that, that they really can't kill this for, because of its effect. Um, one of the best parts I do want to mention about Sailor Dragon here is the card says whenever it's special summon. So if you call the Haunted, bring it back with Red Metal. Um, if Monster Reborn was still in the game, you know, that would be an option. But whenever this card is special summon, its effect applies until your next end phase. So they switched it from the Japanese. It originally was um, posted up on Wikia that its effect only lasts until your standby phase, but they ended up switching it until your end phase of your next turn. So that made, this has made this card really good, in my opinion. Um, some of the best combos I've come up with this and Maiden has been one for one. It's kind of obvious. You guys would ditch probably a white stone or something, get Maiden out, uh, play one to one, equip to it, and summon the blue eyes. Um, another cool combo, Dragon Shrine. I was iffy about this at first, but this is actually one of the best ways to mill out your deck as fast as possible for you to get to your cards way quicker. Um, I also found out an interesting ruling about this that if you send a Gemini mo Dragon type monster, because it was sent to the grave and Geminis are considered normal types when they hit the grave, this the second effect of this that allows you to send another dragon to the graveyard is applied so you'll be able to ditch two month dragons instead of one um one of the one of the interesting rulings i did find out that i found a little bit interesting is book of moon and maiden or compose uh pretty much let's say for example your opponent swings out at maiden Maiden's effect activates to negate the attack, you'll activate Compose or Book of Moon. So the attack will get negated, but Maiden, as soon as Maiden hits face down, you are not able to summon a Blue Eyes. For the simple fact that she has to switch position to resolve her full effect to allow you to summon a Blue Eyes. Um, so that means during your next turn after you negated the attack, and you want to flip Maiden back up, you will be able to summon a Blue Eyes. But if your opponent enters battle phase and you activate any of these two to target her, you're able to, you'll be able to summon a Blue Eyes, your White Dragon, to the field with no problem. Um, one of the best things I found out as well, um, I'm sorry if I'm going a little fast for you guys so you don't understand. Uh, if you have any questions, just leave a, a comment below. But one of the best combos too is using Dragon Soul Castle. Banish any dragon from your graveyard, target one face up monster, and give it a 700 attack point boost. Now banishing the card is a cost, and if this card will be destroyed, you'll be able to summon any dragon. So for example, if I activate this, banish blue eyes, target herbs, I'd be able to summon one blue eyes white dragon, 
And if I want, I could play Double Tornado or MST, pop this, and get another Blue Eyes out or any remove from Play Dragon. I find this interesting because I do, I, I kind of want to see what players will think of this card. I feel like E Dragons might tech it a little bit, not 100% sure. But this is definitely a way to put pressure on your opponent and definitely make them not want to MST or play something like um, Maleficent Catastrophe. I'm sorry if I said it wrong. I have problems sometimes. Um, but moving on. One of the best things I found, like, I actually been laughing about this every time I ca catch my opponent. Um, they'll swing at Maiden and then activate Breakthrough Skill or Skill Drain or they'll affect Valor during my turn and then play something like maybe Battle Mania to make me attack. But as soon as that happens and they swing at my Maiden, I honestly, it's pretty much it ends up to a suicide, but I've caught players with this. Um, they get a little upset, but they also try to lance my Maiden to try to win the battle. And Maiden zero, I'm gonna win. <laughs> But it's funny, um, I do find Maiden to be great. I'm here at my locals right now. I've seen about two to three boxes already bought. I've bought three myself. But I'm, see I'm hoping to see what Maiden is gonna hold for this format, how people are gonna play her. And I'm really hoping for some interesting decks to be played with her. And if anything, I definitely wanna hear your guys' opinion, your guys' deck list or video of what you guys think Maiden will do this format or better yet what do you think blue, is blue eyes gonna make a comeback but this is jay cruz from team shockwave and thank you for listening